Okay, um, what's up guys? It's Tech0808-1996 here. Um... I can just bring it more over here to the light. Okay, um... If I take that off, better, I guess. Um... Now I got some more movies, um, either of these I already owned and just didn't have them on my shelf and they were just my parents' stuff or, well I actually only got two things <clears throat> and um, yeah, the, let me start off with the two things I bought recently. Um, so yesterday I went to HEB and um, there was a 2 for 10, I guess you could call it a sale. They had a lot of things on clearance and stuff. So, I didn't bother looking at those because they're not only terrible movies that I don't seem interested in. Um, but, yeah, this was actually a great find because I've been looking for the adventures of Rocky and Bowingle forever. Just because I loved it when I was a kid. It was one of my favorite movies back in the day. So I finally found it. I watched it the same night. I still love it. It's funny. Just a great movie. Now this one I've been, you know, seeing on shelves and stuff, and it looks kind of interesting. Um, but you know, I just never bought it or seen it. Sorry, just I'm looking at the screen and I, I look in the dark and stuff. Okay. Yeah, this is too dark. Yeah, that seems better. Alright, so, um, anyways, sorry for the little delay. Down a little. Um, okay, so yeah, this one, I seen it, I read the back. Seemed kind of interesting. Um, so I just finally got it. It was two for ten, you know. There w really wasn't anything else there. Um, but this is Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventures. I have no clue if it's good or not. I haven't checked online for anything. And it's kind of like in one of those eco dumb cases. I hate that. I have to switch it out now. But yeah, it just seemed interesting. It has Keanu Reeves, Alex Winter, and George Carlin. Don't know who the last two are. But, yeah, it sounds interesting. It looks good, too. But, you yeah, know, just never got around to it. <clears throat> Alright, now these are the ones that I own from, like, pawn shops or stuff. But, you know, I just never brought them up to my room for my collection. So the first one is Spy Kids 3D. Um, great movie. And um, I'm kind of worried about this new, new Spy Kids. I know it has like the original kids in it, but they're like really old now. Well, not really old, but they're older than this movie. So it comes with a little paper. Um, just has scenes, not much. I think I got this at a pawn shop. So it has two discs. One is the 3D version, and the other is the 2D version. 3D, 2D. So that's pretty cool. Plus, um, I don't I think I misplaced the glasses. This is actually a pretty good deal from a pawn shop, because, as I remember, it, yeah, it's not bad scratch scratches. There, are quite a few. And the 2D version is just like a bunch of fingerprints. But great movie. Um, I love it kind of worried about this next one uh, with uh, Jessica Alba and um, oh, the other guy, I forget his name. Um, but yeah, that one I'm kind of worried about because from what I've seen, it doesn't look that good. Um, I'm still going to see it, you know, just to finish off the Spy Kids. Um, Alright, so the next one I got is a good, a good one. Um, I've lost the second dish of disc apparently. Dang it. 
Um, Nut is Ice Age. Um, great movie. Um, if you haven't seen it, I'm actually pretty shocked. Because everyone knows about Ice Age. It was a two disc. Um, but I am missing the other one. So I'm just, Oh gosh. Had it for a while too. And it had the bonus animated short film Scratch Missing Missing Adventure. Which stinks. Cause this too has a lot of features. I actually had to look for that. Um next is also a good one. Not the best in the four movies that it has, but or f five actually. Hold on. Okay, I was doing a a scan on my computer. And it was blocking the screen. So Shrek, great Mike Myers kids film. Goes with the disc and the little paper. It's just this advertisement for the movies from DreamWorks. Yeah, I had this for a while too. I think we bought it actually from a actual retail retailer. Um, next is a movie that came out after Shrek. Um, it's not part of the four movies. Um, it's kind of like a short, I guess, and that is Shrek 3D. Um, it did come with 3D glasses. Once again, I'm not good with 3D glasses. So <laughs> they're missing as well. There's the back. It's, um, I forget what it's about. But it's where the first movie left off and um, it basically kind of gives a boost start uh, for the second trick. And I like this because it actually comes with this little, I guess, 3D-like cover on front. So yeah, this is a good one. I liked it when I was a kid. I don't like that Prince guy, though. Or Lord Farquaad. I didn't like him that much. Um, no. At seven minutes now. Um, this one I just found, and I'm gonna check if this still works. I hope it does. Cause otherwise, I'm I'm still gonna buy this. I'm just gonna watch this for now. I just wanted to share this with you guys, but um, Fantastic Four. <laughs> um, I guess we had a friend burn it or something. So, yeah, he just printed out a picture from a black and white printer, and then just put it in the front with little tabs. So, I'm going to check if this actually works. I'm still going to buy the film, though, and I just add the official cover. This is interesting. So, yeah, I'm going to check this out for now. Um, but, yeah, I'm gonna alphabetize this now, put them in my, uh, little collection I got, it's over there, it's not much, I know, because I just, like, started last month, I think, last month, or two months ago, I, I started this summer pretty much, um, I didn't have that much um, movies. I wasn't really into movies. I was more into iPod, iPhone stuff. Um, so yeah, um, I was frankly more into video games um, rather than movies. So I didn't really have that much. Plus, I gave over the years I've been born, you know. Garage sales, yard sales, pawn shops. They just diminished little by little. But every now and then I got a DVD. And um, now, I, just now, I started to collect big time. 
And so yeah, that's pretty much my story. Um, right now I'm gonna watch Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure. But yeah, um, thanks for watching, guys, and uh, please hit that subscribe button up there. If you like the video, go ahead and click the like button. Um, if you liked it a lot, favorite it, and please comment. Um, I will try to reply if I have time, or if I get around to looking at my email, because I, I get emails for stuff like that. <clears throat> but yeah, so I haven't put up my CD poster yet. Uh, I still need to clear some room, I think, or I'm just gonna put it on this wall over here instead of that one. But you know. Been having a crazy week, but that's enough rambling because we're already at 11 minutes. So yeah, um, thanks for watching again, um, and peace. See you later.